Pretty wild day today. I, oh gosh, we are already, this is a lagged, hacked lobby. You know why? Because this dude's called fucking obesity leg or obsidy stupid name. All right, it's a stupid name and all this guy does is hack, watch. This lobby's gonna be hacked, completely hacked. Or this guy's gonna have like a billion score, watch. I'm right. Told ya. Three, look at this, so stupid. I'm out of there. I'm out of there. I'm not, I'm not playing your games, kids. I'm not playing your ridiculous lobbies. Dump them. Yes! Now, but today, pretty crazy day if you ask me. Uh, the, 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 there was no harm. Dude, what the fuck? I'm not doing this. Dude, every lobby is hacked right now. But, there was no warm water in the shower. That was already crazy. I almost died last night. I was, put my Parks and Recreation show on, laying there, about to get some snoozies in, open my eyes. There's a big ass spider on my sheet. I say, holy shit, this sp and then I just get up, and I crush that spider. I thought I did, look at it again. It's still running around. Crush it again, it's done. All right, it was dead. I made sure it was dead. Fucking. Spider had last sand and I don't even know man, that thing was alive still after I crushed it with my own hands. That was freaky, so I almost died in my bed. And then for the rest of the night I was forever paranoid that there was more spiders in my bed, so that was already... I, I did sleep kind of well though, I slept alright. It was decent, it was decent, but uh... Yeah, I spoke at a school today. And it was... I was, I was nervous. I was nervous walking in, and uh, it was um, it was it was it wasn't like a high school or anything like that. It was it was a, it was an elementary school, but uh, the, it was I'm really good friends with one of the teachers. He actually helped me get into like working out and all that. Um, and I spoke there, and they had all these questions, and they were like really excited. I never thought like when I started this YouTube thing, I never thought I would be doing. I never thought I'd be speaking at these things. Just die, man. Just just drop. He's gonna be over here. I'm gonna catch this guy off guard here too. Over here. Oh, he got dropped. You gonna chase? I don't know. I'll just meet him around here. Oh, I thought I was gonna kill him. Anyway, so I spoke at this school, and you know, it was more, it was organized. It was cool. He organized it, so he had them all ask me questions, and and I wasn't sitting there talking about like clips or anything like that, like you guys think I would be, or like the fucking ignorant people would think I'd just be sitting there talking about that. I talked more about just doing what you love and, um, you know, like what, what it took to get here and it was just like, just, it was like, you know, you gotta be prepared to, nothing happens overnight, I told him that. And ne never to be scared to, damn it, I was doing so well. And never to be scared to, to do what you love. And, you know, it was more, it was more than just what you guys would assume or just like want to make it smaller, right? Um, it was, it was something that I don't think I'll ever probably forget. Is there another headshot here? There should be. No, he went down. He went down. Oh, now he went up. This guy's still here. Kids are getting the schlong. Anyway. But yeah, it was it was really cool. I got to sat that I sat there and I just I just spoke to them and uh, you know they asked me all these questions. I answered all their questions. And when I started YouTube, I never would have thought I would be like kind of like a in, like a motivational like like just like a speaker at like schools like like I never thought that and like I never I don't really see myself as that person. But when it happened, it just I don't know, man. It was it was crazy, absolutely crazy. Back to the other side. Absolutely wild. I still can't believe it. It was it was very cool though. I was nervous at the start, but then I I started to started to really like just warm up to them and just like you know this is this is what's good. Would you stop? I'm 21 at forward. I'm not playing that bad. Oh, that's how you end a game. <laughs> that's how you end a game. That's just how you do it. was not ready for that. Yeah, I gotta make a bunch of videos over time, um, since as you guys know, New Orleans is actually this week. Quite excited for that. It's been a cool four months 
since I've been to a Call of Duty event in general, and I, I love I love Call of Duty events. It's just like, I don't know, I just haven't, I just didn't feel like going to any of like the events that have been happening, like UMG or anything like that, MES, none of those. Mainly because I just didn't, I don't know, I had been traveling alone for like this entire, this, this entire time of YouTube, and I just didn't feel like traveling, you know? I felt like taking it easy, I didn't feel like traveling anywhere this summer, I just felt like hanging around in town, hanging with the buds. Um, yeah, it was, uh, it's been relaxing, but now it's time we get on the road. It's about time we start making our moves and start going to events more. Or all of them now, we try our best to anyway. All right, so I'm gonna go playing with Sprat and it'll just be a bunch of highlights from here on. So, let's, uh, let's fucking streak this shit up, man. Psych! You thought I was playing more games with Sprat? I actually thought I was too, to be honest. But, uh, you know, I did play with Sprat. I did. But at the at, at the end of the day, we just we just fucking got off. You know, we just kind of got bored. Um, just had to call it a day. That's the thing about this. You don't want to overplay. All right. You don't want to overplay one game because if you do, then we get it. And I know a lot of people say that about the new games, but come on, it's a new game. You know, just play a different game type or some shit like that. But we're gonna be playing hopefully some war. But there just seems to be no fucking war lobbies in existence. So I guess we're playing team deathmatch here. I'll wool that war, buddy. You know how it. Goats? You know how it goes? Alright, we got teamed up on an airfield. That's collat. Oh! No! Dude, that could have been back to back collats, man. I'm upset. Flatter stall this fool. Oh! I was kidding! I didn't think I would actually fucking hit him! Oh my god! I was fucking kidding. I was 100% I didn't think I was ever gonna. He had fucking Juggernaut too? Oh, he got pooped on. This is him. Oh, get pooped on, dude. I was 100% kidding. I fucking called that, though. Bring your PTRS back out. I want it. Oh, damn it. It's over here. Oh, to the dome, boy. Oh, the fucking hit marker. I almost just turned on that guy and destroyed his life. I would have literally destroyed someone's life there. That w that's what would have happened. If I killed that guy, I would have destroyed his life. What? If you don't die, if you don't die, thank you. Oh my gosh, dude, if that guy wasn't gonna die. No. Here we go. Look at you. Dropped. 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 No. Nope. Dropped. You're not killing me. Nope. Dropped. 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 What? Die, man. Just die.
Fuck you. Nice shots there, Pomage. Thank you, Pomage. You're a good guy, Austin. Thank you, Austin, you fucking weirdo. And I died. 